and welcome to the Fix-It Shed. So the mowing season has ended. There are four things that I like to do to prepare my mower for storage and make sure that it's ready to go in the spring. The first, and probably most important, is the gasoline. You can add a fuel stabilizer, but if you aren't doing that, you're going to want to drain the gas out of the fuel system. So here is my gas tank, and right here is the fuel line that runs from the gas tank down to the carburetor. So I'm just going to pop this fuel line off, and I'm going to drain the gas out of the gas tank from there. All right. I'm going to pinch off the fuel line. Move the hose clamp. And pull off the fuel line. Okay. We're going to undo the pinch on the hose, and then the gas is going to drain from the tank into the can. There wasn't a whole lot in there. I'm going to take the cap off too, make sure it's flowing freely. Okay, so now that I've let the engine run until it ran out of gas so that I'm sure that the fuel system is completely empty, uh, I'm going to take the battery out. Some mowers, the battery is under the hood. This mower, it's under the seat. Wow, those aren't very tight. Okay, now I'm going to take this battery and I'm going to store it inside the house so that it stays warm over the winter. So this is also a good time to check things out. This is a plastic battery box, so you don't have to worry about it rusting. Or it looks to be in good shape. So step three, I'm going to remove the mower deck. And I'm going to do this just so that I can get a good cleaning, get all the grass off of it on the top, and scrape out what's underneath. I have shown this before, so I'm not going to go super in-depth, but so there's a cotter pin that I'll get from the other side that'll loosen up that linkage, and then there's that cotter pin there, and that cotter pin there. So I'm going to take those two off on this side, those two off on the other side, the front linkage on the other side, and I'm going to remove the belt. Okay, and there's one more thing I have to loosen. There's a the clutch cable.
got the cable free, I put the spring. That's good to go. Okay, everything's loose. Now we can slide it. While I have the deck off, uh, I'm going to take the blades off as well, and I'm going to clean the stuff off the deck, and I'm going to sharpen the blades. So that's step four. Let's go put an edge on these. Okay, so if you'd like to see a video that goes a little bit more in depth about how I sharpen blades, you, I'll put a link to that over here. These are four things that I like to do when I'm preparing to store my mower for the winter. Uh, there are other things that we could have done, such as changing the oil and filter, greasing the front end, changing the air filter, spark plug, that kind of stuff. I prefer to leave those for springtime when I'm getting ready to use the mower again. If you have any things that you like to do to prepare your mower for storage that I missed, please feel free to leave them in the comments section. So this is where I would normally reinstall the mower deck, but where I'm going to be storing this, it's actually easier for me to store it if I don't have the mower deck on it. So I'm going to leave it off, and then I'll put it back on in the spring when I'm ready to start mowing again. So if you found something useful in this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, please subscribe. Take care.